There's the National Theater. <laughs> Ivan Vazov was probably Bulgaria's most famous writer. What you see in the back, that statue is new. It's the Battenberg Square. What that screen does, I believe, is it... I know it shows fragments of whatever what, but it's basically a person standing. I don't like it at all, but whatever. There's a Christmas market. I have no idea where the entrance is. Oh, there's the exit. No, don't feel like it. To me, there's no sense in all that. Like, either be open or just don't open at all. Ah, oh, look at this line. Wow, that's for the Christmas market. <laughs> so here are all the people. Now there's absolutely no way that I'll go in. It's an interesting scene, uh, what I'll show you. <laughs> you can see here the line of people waiting to go into the Christmas market. It goes all the way here, around. And all of these people want to go there. Uh, I think it's completely insane to stand in line for something like this, but uh, I don't know, people want to do something. At least I applaud that they don't lay under their bed out of fear tonight. At least they go out and live their life. It's not my thing to stand in line. Here you see a lot of police because there's a protest coming or going on. I don't know if I can cross here to the tunnel. Здравейте, може ли да се мина към там? Тондуков. Добре. Need to walk around this whole building. Need to walk around the whole building to get to the, the tram stop. Uh, this seems to be a pretty massive protest tonight that will start. They tend to take place around 6-7 o'clock in the evening. Right now it's past 5, so it will still start. But you can see there's a reasonable amount of police. And the protest, I don't know where it will start, it's probably where we saw it earlier near the church and it will end up here eventually. They typically do a little walk through the center. Uh, it depends, you follow the, the instructions on the Facebook page and uh, that's how people gather. And now that we're here, I might as well show you this. probably a generator for heating these people have been uh, have been here the whole summer in tents living here what you see over there is the is a government building as well and people have thrown pumpkins at the building it could be the case that the protest already passed here I'm not up to date on what happens Exactly, but it's been like this all summer. You see the pumpkins there, and uh, it just kind of extends it, everything extended for many months. So, the whole summer we've had the police standing here with the cars, 
uh, some ambulances it's gone on for months 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 but right now often the, the protests are not frequent frequented in numbers that large so what they do instead is they protest basically every day but every now and then they do an uprising and that's when they call up all the people to come and during the uprising you see massive numbers and although I cannot be certain probably tonight is an uprising like they do it on the weekend when people are free and during the uprising they uh, they come by the thousands perhaps tens of thousands to protest against the, the government the misuse of funds the corruption the everything everything it's a boiling point of everything that comes together people are just not satisfied with the way things are going and that uh, has been going on for so long now I don't know how it will how it will turn out I don't know what to expect it's been going on quite long not many reforms have been done there's been a few I'm not gonna discuss all of it but people have a long breath here and so does the government so I don't know if if there will be some sort of stalemate or uh, resolutions of any kind or people just give up I have no idea after all winter is coming so what are you going to do outside unless you're a true a true uh, die hard <laughs> or obviously you want to fight for your country like uh, like you should why not and you can hear the whistles in the back people screaming yelling Ostavka which is a uh, resignation people want the whole government to resign all at once with the main the main characters eventually I don't know what I propose as a change and that's why I don't cover it because I'm uninformed and I, I'm not going to do a whole lot of research about it I just want to live my life do footage that as you can see how I live here that's my topic either way I'll hop on the tram get home as soon as it comes uh, watch the footage of me <laughs> on TV it's kind of strange but uh, getting used to it it will be the sixth or seventh broadcast on TV been on three four channels right now I've had all the main ones national television BTV Bulgaria television and now on Nova new television So either way, you can hear intensified yelling people, so that means the protest is passing by here. And it's a strange dynamic because you see on the one hand that people do the protest, oh they're coming by here, so I can cover that as well. That people do the protest, they are upset that nothing's changing, in their view. And on the other hand, you have the people standing in line for the Christmas market. It is in exactly the same street. That people just want to move on, live their life. Yeah, you can see it there on the back. Uh, the flags. We just do a circle every time it's uh, another another direction it goes through the whole center and people are pissed off but it's still early so probably the thousands are still to come at the later stage in about an hour or so let's say after dinner time that's when that's when it really starts. Alright, so we'll see you in the next video. Take care.